In Exodus chapter 3, you all remember uh, when Moses was at the mountain. And we're at Mount Zion tonight. The pinnacle. We're on the mountain. And when Moses was on that mountain at Horeb, he noticed something that he had seen before, but something was different. He, he saw a bush burning, but the bush didn't burn up. So he turned aside to see this great sight, and a voice spoke to him out of the bush. And the voice said, Moses, take off your shoes. And, and most of us know, especially black folk, we know your feet are the most sensitive thing on your body. No, I'm serious. I'm going somewhere, but just stay with me. What, Mo, what God was telling Moses, Moses, I need you to be sensitive to what's going on. Mount Zion, I need you to be sensitive to what's going on. Two weeks ago, this man, my pastor, our pastor, stood, installed a man, help a young man organize a church, Trenches Community Church, less than two weeks ago. I need you to be sensitive to, to what's happening now. I need you to understand that you're having a mountaintop experience. On tonight, he has a son of the church that has been shipped to Battle Creek to do a work for God. He's here tonight to preach the ordination sermon of another son of this house. Mount Zion, if, if you ever ask a question about breakfast, if you ever ask a question about the building fund, if you ever wondering the validity, the power, the influence of this church, you got to be kidding me. I need Mount Zion to recognize that God is doing a mighty work through the Moses of our time he's not just spilling his seed like some daddies he's spilling his seed as a father planting churches so he can accomplish your mission of growing God's kingdom Mount Zion please recognize the work God is doing through this great man of God thank you Pastor Mo God bless you I, I just I had to do that I, I had to do that if, if you see what God is doing not two weeks ago and now two weeks later and now another song is going out and some more songs will be going out I just need Mount Zion to know I need you to know and I don't you don't need to get silly you need to understand that you are growing God's kingdom according to his word so thank you Dr. Moore